Hi everyone, this is Sin. I just wanted to do a quick, um, it's actually going to be a review for the Gilio. Um, they're asking for Gilio reviews and we could, it's a contest and we can win 100 euros. And since I love Gilio so much that I thought I would do a review. Um, I have moved into my pocket Mia Cara just today and um, I went from a pocket Campania to a Mi uh, Mia Cara but still a pocket size so I just wanted to do a quick review this is my brand new to me um, Yale blue light blue which is a dual color so you can see there's contrast stitching um, it's very smooth leather this is the Yale blue on the outside and it's light blue on the inside as you can see the contrast colors um, what can I say about Gilio? I love them. I, on, I only have Gilio. I have one VDS and I have one Filofax, which I don't um, use. I haven't used a VDS yet, but um, there's, to me there's no comparison. The Gilio leather is, it's called Epoca leather and it's vegetable tanned, I believe, all naturally tanned. And it's just beautiful. Um, this is brand new, not used except today, so it's kind of little stiff but after about a week's use the epoca leather softens up and gets um, a nice patina on it so I can't wait to start um, getting these leathers pliable. The pocket Mia Cara is it's actually quite a large um, as you can see it's quite a large even though it's pocket size the footprint is pretty big because it's a planner within a planner so you could um, you can the ringed portion comes out you can make it come out and then if you just want to carry this one you can I do use it as a wallet planner so I do um, it's an everyday planner carry and in the there's a popper pocket which is perfect for extra gift cards which I have stuck in there I have coins um, in there and it's a nice big gusseted pocket so you can put you know whatever you want in there coins stickers etc um, there is also a slip in pocket underneath I don't have anything in there as of now this is where the pen holder goes um, if you can see the pen goes in here which I also don't use um, I usually stick my pen on the side um, of the planner portion there's six credit card pockets which I have back here for not as um, not daily use and it has the big pocket in the back which also holds it holds my um, paper money and it holds important papers that I need to work on or whatever but it's it's really big so you could um, put an eight and a half by eleven letter, letter size just fold it in half and it fits in there it's perfect there's another slip in pocket here which usually the planner portion slips in as you can see but um, you can also slip small things in there stamps and whatnot and this is it without the planner portion Again, the leather is just wonderful. It's beautiful. It smells incredible. There's nothing like Gilio leather, in my opinion. Um, even in the high designer, um, you know, which costs thousands and more, like our maze, I to me, the Gilio leather is superior. This is the planner portion where I have my whole year's worth in here. Um, I'll do a setup video later. This is just a review. In these um, credit card pockets, I have what I use daily, um, credit cards, debit cards, um, my Costco card, my driver's license, and I also always have my little decorations. And that's the planner portion. The rings um, are about 15 to 19 millimeters. They are oval shaped, so they do hold quite a bit. As you can see, um, you know, mine holds quite a lot. And um, that's it. So this is my quick review of the Gilio. Again, I love it. Love the Gilio. There's nothing like it. If you want to go, um, I will put a link in the description below 
of their website. Okay, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Bye.